beloved child. Many wonderful things are coming your way. I encourage you to believe this. You've remained strong through tough times. I ask you to keep standing strong. I see how tired you are, how your spirit feels drained, but I'm urging you to keep going. A new time of peace is on the horizon. Hold on to your beliefs tightly. Keep fighting. Keep aiming for victory. Get ready to receive the answers to your prayers that you've been eagerly waiting for. Now is not the time to give up and let defeat take over. Don't let your joy be stolen by those who don't want to see your success. They've seen your unwavering faith, your bravery, and your inner strength. You're almost there. Soon, you'll reach a place where legions of warrior angels are ready to support you in your battles. Wonderful blessings, huge happiness, and amazing gifts are coming your way. You'll also find joy in your responsibilities, not burdens. Victory is closer than you think. The place you thought was far off will soon be within your reach. I plan to put you in a new setting, surrounded by kind and harmonious people, free from debts and eager to work towards the exciting goals awaiting in your life. Embrace this joy with faith, even if you can't see or feel it yet. Keep pushing forward with joy towards what you want, all the way to the end. Accept it with faith. I know you understand. You're not an accident. You are my child, chosen by me from the very start. You're well aware of this because I've shown you many signs. Ignoring my words and the miracles I want to bring into your life and your families would be a huge mistake. Don't let imaginary barriers hold you back. I'm going to bless you, and there is nothing or no one who can prevent me. I have forgiven you and cleansed you, and if there is still something you hide from me, you will bring it to me today. There is no excuse or reason that can hinder you from receiving my love and forgiveness. I desire to bless you, and even you yourself cannot prevent it. If you try to place obstacles, I will remove them with the affection I hold for you. I have sent my word to be fulfilled in your life, and that word I have sent will not return to me empty. It will come bearing fruits and miracles, victories and joys. I'm going to show you something amazing, and once you grasp it, you won't ever drift away from this wonderful love I have for you. I love you. Don't be scared. There's a special place for you with me. It doesn't matter if others turn their backs on you. Even when you treat them kindly and with respect, some ungrateful people might still look down on you. So today, I aim to fortify your spirit, your mind, and your body, so you won't get upset or sick from so much disappointment anymore. What you truly need is genuine love, sacred, flawless, everlasting, pure, real, and this is the love I offer you. Those who've hurt you might say they'll provide love but always want something back. If you don't comply, they add to your suffering. But today you're getting liberated from this bondage. You won't rely on anyone else in this world. You won't need flattering words to feel valued, nor will you feel down when no one talks to you unless they need something or want to blame you for their problems. I'm breaking every spiritual chain, every emotional tea, setting you free from the undue burden placed on you because you trusted too readily. Your adversary may disguise himself as a beacon of goodness, aiming to take what's yours. But I'm not after your wealth or belongings. Your material things don't matter to me. I wish for you to live without sadness or despair. You will live for me and be incredibly strong. You will no longer feel hurt when many ignore you or fail to place blind trust in any human being, no matter how pure and good they may seem. You will truly be brave and very happy if you give importance to my word, if you accept my will, if you patiently await all the blessings I will bestow upon you. I don't want you to be alone either. At just the right moment, I'll bring the perfect person into your life. 
I'll provide the job you need and open up opportunities for you. I'll bless you generously and clear your debts. I'll take care of all this. You just need to stay humble and thankful. Believe in my love and strength that I'm going to work wonders in you. You'll be filled with happiness. Come and trust in me. You're in for some wonderful surprises. Look for me daily. Let me know you trust me. Life is full of changes. Whatever comes your way, keep a strong and faithful perspective. Remember, I'll turn everything that happens to you into something beneficial. If the path seems difficult, do not stop. If someone tries to discourage you with lies, do not believe them. You and your family are protected in my hands. Nothing bad will happen to you. But do not let your guard down. The enemy wants to attack you and is looking for someone who's careless and distracted to devour. I don't want the enemy to defeat you. That's why I remind you daily that you're not walking alone on this journey of life. You have me and your family. Even if it seems like they don't always back you up or appreciate what you do, I see your faith, your dedication, and your efforts for them. Your home is blessed because of your prayers. Angels stand by, watching over your loved ones thanks to you. Your steadfastness matters a lot in heaven. I know you're not flawless, but your heart is in the right place. You've entrusted me with your soul and your heart. You didn't give up when faced with danger or quit during tough times. I truly value your character. Absorb my words and let them imprint on your soul. Continue to pray, fight, strive, and believe. My promises come true. My words turn into reality. Your troubles will cease. Your blessings are on their way. Start listing the people you plan to help first. When your time to give and support others comes, I will increase your resources. Your family won't go without. I will bless you richly. I will provide for you. I will gift you the wisdom to avoid and manage debts effectively. Forget me. Not amidst your prosperity. Remember the prayer and my words. Always place me foremost. I await you tomorrow at the same place in the silence of your chamber, with a willing heart. Come, read, and heed my words. Offer me your time, bend your knees, and prepare your soul with my embrace. I shall envelop you, making you feel my presence. With my spirit I will bless your life, your family, and your home. Today, you will feel uplifted as my love surrounds you and your loved ones. When you embrace these words with an open heart, they instill faith and confidence in you, for my blessing is already in your grasp. You have risen to a state of blessedness. I've removed sadness from your spirit and body. I'm healing you, writing words of kindness on your mind and eliminating the deep-seated causes of your spiritual troubles. In the spiritual world, you are dressed in royal clothes, sitting next to me, showered with plentiful blessings. It's crucial that you truly believe and accept these promises with faith. My powerful blood has raised you, filling you with my strength and breaking all the chains binding you. No one can keep you imprisoned. You are free. Yet I desire that you live as such. When you pray, Receive this supernatural encouragement that I bestow upon you. From this day forth you shall witness numerous blessings emerging from the very problems that once troubled you. Instead of pessimism, your countenance shall radiate with joy, for you now walk in faith in my word, and your emotions shall not be shattered by the negative things your eyes perceive. I am with you and merely knowing this shall fuel your desire to persevere. Each day, you shall rise with renewed zest for life, steadfastly treading the righteous path, taking courageous steps akin to a hero of faith, uplifting your family, and refusing to regress to the realms of failure where others seek to confine you. These words bring life. They refresh your soul as you hear them. 
Every day your heart fills with happiness when you remember and say them out loud. I am your provider and you can trust that, despite any difficulties, everything will turn out well, even better than you might expect. This power I constantly talk about gives you control over your feelings through my Holy Spirit. You can manage what you say, stopping any grumbling or negative talk. The fire inside you is turning all barriers into dust. Open your eyes. Stand firm. Let me hold you close and whisper in your ear once more. My dear child, do not be afraid. I love you. You will feel better. All will be well. I need to tell you that your waiting is nearly over. Your goal, your deep desire, your blessing, they're all coming true right now. Get your heart ready, because the joy could be so overwhelming and the surprise so wonderful that you might wonder if you truly deserve all I'm ready to give you. I speak to your soul once more, tenderly urging you to renew your thoughts. I understand that you cannot do so on your own strength. I will aid you where you falter. However, you must rise in faith. Your Bible awaits begin reading it daily. Seek the company of those who inspire belief, who speak words of encouragement and aid in your growth. I am not distant. I am right beside your bed. Each morning you can kneel or simply close your eyes in your home or venture out to bask in the sunlight. Speak to me. Tell me your feelings, your thoughts. What are your reasons for living always grateful? Which things and individuals make you feel blessed? Write my word and place it before your eyes in concise verses that you may memorize. Not to mindlessly repeat, but to contemplate. To grasp my love and power and to learn to have faith in my profound affection for you. I desire to bless you and your family with a beautiful and perfect plan. The day has arrived for you to receive what you have long awaited. You need not continue weeping or enduring distress. There shall be no lack in your household, in every facet of your life. Peace and abundance, I desire to make this covenant with you. Come and listen to me every morning. Receive this word into your heart, which shall grant stability and peace, bringing clarity to your mind. Renew your way of thinking from this moment onward. Expect my visit to your home before the year is out. I will fill you and your loved ones with harmony, love, gentleness, and happiness. I love you. Do you have a moment for me today, wherever you are, in the quiet of your room, or wherever you find yourself? Open up your heart. Let go of the pain you're holding inside. Share with me those hidden feelings you might not want others to know, but you and I do. In this moment, you give to me, I will heal your spirit and invigorate your emotions so you can always feel good. When I see you're upset, I come to soothe your heart with my loving touch that mends you. There might be times when you don't even realize why worries weigh you down. Recall those times of sadness and stress. It's not wrong to yearn for an embrace or someone to hear you out, offering their ear, patience, and no judgment. I get your need. That's why I'm talking to you now. Yet I need to say, if you're pinning your hopes on people around to uplift you when you're down, you might end up waiting quite a bit. They're just like you. Their souls have their own sorrows too. Place your trust in me and your hope in my love. I shall not disappoint you, nor shall I withhold my attention. I desire for you to feel enveloped in tenderness and abundant affection, so that in your moments of sorrow, you may come and confide in me with the sincerity and innocence of a child. I've shown you many times how deep my love for you is, but I'll say it again. I will lift you from your sadness and loneliness. I'll pick you up and raise you high. I want you to see all the blessings that belong to you. Sometimes life's challenges hide the wonderful future I've planned for you. I'm so glad you've taken some time today to hear these comforting words. 
you'll leave here empowered, with a smile on your face and joy in your eyes. Visit me every day, spare some moments for me. And when you come feeling stressed and tired, you'll always find comfort in talking with me. I'll be waiting for you here tomorrow if you want to leave behind today's worries. Listen closely now. The answers you need will come from me. Your problems might seem too complicated, but remember, you've given me your life and your heart. I've convinced you that for me, nothing is impossible. I want you to consider it, to speak it, to proclaim it, to inscribe it, but my greatest desire is for you to believe it. Shout it out now with faith. Nothing is impossible for God. Embrace this certainty. My promise is alive. When I send forth my word to heal your land and bring about changes in your life, it shall not return to me empty. At times it may seem difficult for things to change, but you are a child of the omnipotent God. Urgently renew your way of thinking. I have bestowed upon you the Holy Spirit. You also carry within you my supernatural power. Powerful miracles will occur when you speak my word with love, when you treat others with gentleness, when you control your temperament and cease to shout at those around you, when you cease to offend with your mannerisms. Show love to those you should instead of causing them pain. I'm opening your eyes to see incredible things. When you call to me, I'll answer with wonderful truths. Make it a habit to seek my words daily. Listen with focus. Attune your hearing. Dive into your Bible. Know for sure that you're part of a heavenly realm where you're loved, shielded, led, and guided by your Father in heaven. At all times, everywhere, whether you're feeling good or bad, I'll always be there for you, just as my promises say. But there's something crucial you need to grasp. Your spirit and mine are linked. You have access to a realm of wonders. Yet you live in the earthly realm. Challenges will come, disputes will arise, and foes will try to hurt you. It's all part of your life's path. But nothing will overcome or defeat you. My support is yours. My help is ready, and my word lives in your heart. You have the might of a victor. Your steadfast faith is the key you need right now. Rise up and confront your problems with determination. I love you so deeply and I am strengthening you. Tell me that you believe in me. Shout it out. Write it once more. Nothing is impossible for God. I have many good tidings to impart to you. Before you lies the blessing you have awaited so eagerly. The days ahead shall be filled with joy and happiness for you and your family. I'm clearing away the gloom that overshadows your thoughts. I've erased all repercussions and curses from your missteps. Nothing will block the wonderful blessings I plan to give you, for I have personally wiped out the debt of guilt and regret your foe wanted to charge you with. Even as the world is caught in fear and uncertainty, you can reach out to me directly. You're my cherished, safeguarded child. You have the full right to call out to me and be listened to. While others look for safety in what they own or control, you should be brimming with assurance because your hope lies in me. I will never leave you. You need to have faith and trust. Stand firm in this grace. Stay steadfast in your commitment. You have the power to stand through storms, to command them to be still, and they will listen. Don't be scared. Just try, and you will witness it. When conflicts try to trap you with their tricks, raise your hands and triumph. As you call out to me, barriers blocking your path will fall. The forces against you will get stuck. Stand up and walk. Spread these joyful messages to everyone who needs to hear them. My power accompanies you, and when you speak and share these words, miracles shall occur. No nation, leader, or government can provide the security your soul requires. They may offer peace and prosperity, but you shall never see them. For with each passing hour, the darkness enveloping humanity grows deeper. Do not depend on anyone else in this world. 
Do not surrender your life to human beings who also err. Do not be impressed. Do not be astonished by those who feign power. Not everyone who calls me Lord, Lord, will enter into my presence. Be wary of those who assure you of miracles in return for your gifts, who try to awe you with their loud prayers. Put your trust solely in me. You'll know my voice when I speak to you. I am your God, the one who made you, your rescuer. I bring you news that will make your heart rejoice. While others may feel downcast, you will stand up with joy. When some think they can't endure anymore, you, filled with my love and the Holy Spirit, will rise each day. Today I will lead you on paths of goodness. I don't want you walking in obscurity. I wish for you to feel cherished and safe. This is what I desire. Your faith delights me. How you believe is your way of adoring me. And in your worship, peace and strength will flood your being. I shall continue to guide you. Keep seeking. These times are difficult, but I shall continue to help you, even in moments when you feel weak, when your faith falters and you think you have strayed from me. Even on those days I shall be by your side. I shall continue to guide you. I shall take your hand if necessary. I shall carry you in my arms. You have told me that you love me. You have considered me a friend. You have given me your time, and I've demonstrated my love to you, and I shall not change. You're aware that I'm constant in your tough times. I won't leave you when you're feeling weak. I won't wander away when you're doubtful, when your mind swirls with questions. I'll stand by you, ready to respond once more. You shouldn't shrink back in these situations. In hard times, never lose faith. Your all-powerful God assures you, nothing is too hard for me. I will perform marvelous deeds in your life, my child. Listen to my voice, heed my words, and let peace and serenity fill your heart. I aim to bring steadiness to your thoughts, joy and contentment to your life. I don't want you to be troubled over what's gone, the time that's passed, or the people who've departed leaving you sad and wounded. There was a time when the enemy whispered that I didn't love you, suggesting that your struggles meant I had left you. But today, you feel my presence and you trust the truth. My love for you is profound and you're certain I'll never forsake you. My Holy Spirit, my glorious presence will fill you, will bless you. My love is deep. I trust you'll always believe in it. I need to share something crucial with you, so listen closely. Don't overlook this message. Embrace every word I'm about to say and share your thoughts on this issue I wish to discuss with you. I'm here to assure you that I'll never cease to express my love for you each day, finding tender and delightful ways to ensure you feel encircled, safeguarded, perpetually graced by this immense love I have for you. My feelings do not change. My covenant of love with you is written in my word, signed with my own blood and sealed with the presence of my Holy Spirit, which lives and burns in your heart like a flame that burns the impurities of your soul, like a powerful wind that uproots every painful memory from the root, fills you with peace and tenderness, gives you a secure strength, a divine peace that gives firmness to your feet, helps you stand up, rise again, fight for life, give more love to your family. This mighty power I give you is enveloped in everlasting love. I came to rescue you and to promise you a marvelous place in heaven. One day you'll be with me, but while you're here on earth, I wish for you to recall these words every night. Before you sleep, especially on nights when your eyes shed many tears, Lay your head down on your pillow, cast aside your worries, stretch out your hands, and welcome this heavenly oil that heals both body and spirit. You'll sleep soundly, free from any upset, and upon waking, you'll be greeted by a sense of renewal, not anxiety. I'll keep reminding you. Do I need to tell you every moment how much I cherish, respect, and value you? 
I'm actively smoothing your way and ensuring your well-being. I desire peace for your family, wisdom for your children, abundance in your home without debts, and the permanent departure of any deep-seated distress. You'll hear me. You'll sense my presence. I'll keep offering you my affection, whispering lovingly that my love for you is eternal, magnificent, and supernatural. Say yes, you're open to hearing, eager to feel it. Express your love for me, my child. Today I am giving you a new life. From now on, everything will change. Start this day with your head held high and your heart full of faith. You will see that everything transforms little by little around you. Never forget, in every minute of today I am with you, giving you the strength you need to overcome every challenge giving you the sensitivity to receive all the beauties and small blessings I am giving you. Do not drift away from me, and do not get distracted by the negativity of the world. Be positive, even if everything around you seems to collapse. Just breathe my peace, give your heart a chance to rest, and remember that everything has a purpose, and I am your omnipotent God. I know everything that happens. I am helping you in difficult situations and also in small things. No detail escapes me. I give you my love and I want you to have compassion for others, to love them, to be patient with them. I want you to forgive them. Your attitude towards those people can make many of them come to me. Today I give you new strength to start again. I give you wisdom to solve all your problems. Live this day with joy and joy because everything is already in my hands. I know all your difficulties and your feelings. Just calm down, have faith, and strive to give your best. If you feel lonely, do not be afraid. Just pray and you will feel that I never left your side. My love for you and those you care about knows no bounds. With the promises I offer you, have faith, trust in me, and chase after your dreams, for I will make things better and smoother than you could ever picture. And when evening falls, be grateful for all your experiences. Your thankfulness matters a lot. Your mindset has immense power. Remember, my child, I am with you today, tomorrow, and forever. Today, I am here to remove that unexplainable worry weighing on your heart. I aim to eliminate anything that brings you unexplained sadness. I cherish you and have real divine happiness in store for you. In my hands, I hold your declaration of freedom, sent directly from heaven. My child, hand over your despair and any worries, no matter where you are. As you listen to me, I am gently touching your head. The healing touch of my Holy Spirit is washing over you now. Any sickness, any mental distress, that secret agony ripping through your soul. Hear my commanding voice now. Be healed. You are purified from head to toe, into the deepest recesses of your mind. You do not have to keep suffering. You have direct access to my throne. I am your father, and the gift of life I gave you is for you to enjoy with those you love. Pay attention. I give you the energy and encouragement so that every morning you wake up with a fresh light in your eyes. Go outside your home. Let the sunlight touch your face and the breeze brush against you. At the same time, lift your arms boldly, declaring to everyone that I am your shepherd, your provider, your healer, your protector. Trust me, my words are like a lamp that lights up your path and a lighthouse that brightens your surroundings. They are the directions that will lead you safely to a place of supernatural possibilities where you can work and prosper. But first, you need to heal your fears. They have to vanish and your feelings need to become steady. You can't receive new blessings if you're burdened with worry. Stop dwelling on what's behind you. I am the Uniki, holy and supernatural solution to all your troubles. Approach with confidence when you feel unwell. Grant yourself a fresh chance.
Your sadness, pain, anguish, and despair are now behind you. Today, you are liberated, healed. Let me hold you close for a moment and share some beautiful words that will strengthen you. So every day, you'll wake up full of strong faith in the deep love I have for you. I surround you with my love, peace, and kindness, wrapping you in a blanket of calm, gently stroking your head, whispering, I love you, my child. My love is so immense that no words can fully describe it. Yet you can feel it deeply. You must embrace it. You deserve to enjoy it. Your darkest days are fading and the hurts reminding you of the past. I am healing them. Look forward to a brighter future where you and your family live in peace, bathed in my blessings. It's no accident you're reading this. You've been waiting for my reply. Accept it. Take it to heart. Feel my tender touch on your soul right now, affirming there's healing for your pain. Don't just sit and think about what you could do, the places you want to go, or believe your dreams are too far out of reach. On your own, you might not manage. But with my help, anything good can be achieved if you just believe. Ignore jealousy and negative comments. Some thought you had failed, but you have every right to keep going. You didn't really fail. You just stumbled and felt weak. But I was there to pick you up and make you strong. I won't let anyone mock you. I take my role in caring for and protecting those I love very seriously, and I won't allow anyone to demean them. You are precious to me, which is why I'm talking to you now, alerting you that while many blessings are on their way, there are also those who envy the good things and beauty I'm giving you. Look for me earnestly, because I want to give you a lot of wisdom to help you see dangers, expose false friends, and notice the opportunities and blessings that are coming. My blessing is on you and your family. All your good and fruitful efforts will be richly blessed. I'll give you clear thinking so you can make plans and organize those dreams you've been holding on to. The journey has been tough, and there were many things you couldn't do. But in the coming days, you will be prospered and blessed by my love and strength. Amen.